Hi Evelyn. I wanted to show you how to fold one of those fortune tellers and I sent you one in the mail but I thought you could make these on your own. So you start out with a piece of paper but you can't work with a rectangular paper it has to be square. So I'm going to fold it to make a little triangle or make a big triangle. Yes. See? And now I'm going to cut off this top part. You can use the scissors or whatever you have to, to cut that. Okay. So cut that off. And now I've got a triangle. And I open the triangle up and I've got a square. Okay. So now I'm going to take this triangle and I want to fold it to make another triangle. I'm going to use my fingernails to make a nice hard crease. And then I'm going to open it up. And I'm going to undo the creases. So now what I've got is I've got a piece of paper with an X through the middle. Now I'm going to take it, I'm going to fold it to make a rectangle like this. So I've got a rectangle and now I'm going to fold that to make a square. And now I open it up and I open the creases. So now I've got a big square and I've got an X and a plus sign, a little cross. Okay, so now I lay it down and I'm gonna fold the corner into the center. So it's going to look like this. See? And I was really careful that this tip, it doesn't cross the center point. So that's one. And now I'm going to do the same thing to the remaining three corners. So that's one corner. Let's do... second corner and now the third corner and now the fourth corner and something in order to make this work uh, you do want to have a little bit of a a little bit of a gap here. See, so I didn't fold it exactly to the center, but I folded it pretty close to the center. So this is where we are so far. Now I'm going to take this and I put the fold sides down. So I've got the smooth side. And now I'm going to fold these corners in. So they look like this now. So those are the folds in the back. <clears throat> and I fold this corner in. And now I do the same thing to the other three corners. So here's the second corner. And now the third corner. And now the fourth corner. And again, when I did this, see, I didn't fold them exactly into the center, but I got them close. And that left a little gap there. And now I'm going to take it, I'm going to fold it, and kind of work it back and forth a little bit. And that's it.
so I can take and I can put my fingers in this. And you've got one of those little folded fortune tellers. Anyway, I thought this is something that you might you might enjoy. Uh, I love you and have a good night.